this question we've been asked to solve sine 2x minus 10 in brackets equals negative 0.6. So to do this, first thing we're going to need to do is to look at the values for x. So we've got this between 0 and 180, but we want 2x minus 10. So we're going to times this by 2 to get 0 x 2x and 360. Then we're going to take away 10 to get negative 10, 2x minus 10 and 350. So we've changed our values for x to 2x minus 10. Now what we need to do is to consider our cast diagram. So we've got sine and then uh, we've got 0 0.6, or my negative 0 0.6. So we're going to do the inverse sine of just the 0 0.6 to find the acute angle. So let's do that. So shift sine 0 0.6 equals. So that gives us 36.9. I'll just do it to one decimal place. So that's 36.9 and we'll put that onto our cast diagram. Okay, so that means that all the angles between the x-axis and the lines are 36.9. 36.9, 36.9, and 36.9. Okay, so we've got all our angles. Now we next need to now consider where, which options we're going to choose. So because it's negative 0.6, it means we're going to be looking for the quadrants that the sign is negative in. So the sign's positive in A and it's positive in S, so it's going to be T and C, the bottom two. Okay, so let's find our solutions. We need to go between negative 10 and 350. So let's try the negative 10 first of all. So that's going to be starting here and going clockwise 10 degrees. So if we go 10 degrees, we're not going to reach the 36.9. So that one's not going to work. So we're now going to go back to zero and we're going to go around 350 degrees. So as we go around, so we're not going to take the first solution, or that one, we're going to go around to the t quadrant. So this solution here will be 180, so let's write our 2x minus 10 equals, well we've got um, 180 plus 36.9, so 180 plus 36.9, and that equals 216.9 degrees. And then we've got our next solution, where well we're going to go on around, and we just need to check that it's going to be less than um, 150, so it's going to be 360 minus the 36.9, which will be 323.1, so that will be another solution. And then we go around to 100, uh, 350 and stop, so we've got our two solutions. So we've got our solutions for 2x minus 10, but we've been asked to find x, so we're going to need to then solve that. So we're going to add 10 to both, to both answers, so that'll be 226.9 and 333.1 degrees. Now we're gonna divide both of them by two, so then that will give our answers to dividing 226.9 by two gives us 113.45 degrees, and dividing 333.1 by two, we get our answer there of 166.55 degrees. And that's it, so that's our answer.